Devon Rex Cat vs. Exotic Cat What are the differences between these two cat breeds? The Devon is often described as having an elfin appearance, with his large ears, high cheekbones and striking eyes. His outstanding characteristic, however, is his soft, wavy fur. His curvy body starts with his head, a modified wedge shape with convex curves forming the outer edge of the ear lobes, the cheekbones and the whisker pads. The Devon has large, wide-set, oval-shaped eyes and strikingly large ears set low on the head. Sometimes the tips of the ears are tufted with fine fur. A rexed coat is soft and fine, appearing to be without the harsh guard hairs that characterize most cat coats. The cat's body is well covered with fur, most thickly on the back, sides, tail, legs, face and ears. Some Devons have loose, shaggy curls, while others have a coat that is more thin and suede-like. The hair on the top of the head, the neck, chest and abdomen is slightly less dense and may even look downy, but the cat should never have bare patches. Smooth the coat with your hand and rippled waves appear. It comes in any genetically possible color, pattern or combination of colors and patterns, including solid white, black, blue, chocolate, cinnamon, lavender and red, smoke patterns, which are a white undercoat deeply tipped with a specific color, and various calico, tabby, tortoise shell and pointed patterns. A Devon's medium-sized body is deceptively slender, unless the cat has been sneaking too many snacks. His body should feel hard and muscular. The legs are long and slim, supported by small, oval paws. A long, fine tail covered with short fur tapers at the end. In all respects but coat length, the exotic shares the Persian's sweet expression and soft round lines. It has a large, round head, large, round eyes, a short nose, full cheeks, and small ears with rounded tips. The head is supported by a short, thick neck and a deceptively sturdy, muscular body, a type known as kabi. An exotic's legs are short, thick and strong with large, round, firm paws. The tail is short but proportional to the length of the cat's body. A medium-length soft, thick, plush coat with a rich, thick undercoat completes the exotic's look. It does not have the rough or the plume-like tail of the Persian. Exotics come in different looks, known as extreme and traditional. Extreme exotics, those seen in the show ring, have a flatter face, which may come with breathing problems. Cats with the traditional look have a more old-fashioned appearance, with a face that is not as flat and a nose that is set lower on the face with more of a break, permitting easier breathing. They are registered by the traditional cat association. Exotics of all stripes stand out for their infinite variety of coat colors and patterns. Imagine, if you will, seven solid color divisions, white, blue, black, red, cream, chocolate and lilac, plus silver and golden division colors of chinchilla and shaded silver or golden and blue chinchilla and blue shaded silver or golden. And then there are the shaded, smoke, tabby, calico, particolor and bicolor divisions. That's not counting the various pointed patterns of the Himalayan. Hello. This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. The Devon's favorite perch is right at head level, on the shoulder of his favorite person. He takes a lively interest in everything that is going on and refuses to be left out of any activity. Count on him to stay as close to you as possible, occasionally communicating his opinions in a quiet voice. He loves people and welcomes the attentions of friends and family alike. This is a smart cat with a moderate activity level. He's not in constant motion, but he does like to learn tricks and play fetch. Puzzle toys and interactive toys are a delight to his inventive brain and will help to keep him occupied while you are out earning money to buy more of them. At mealtime, the Devon will try to seat himself at the dining room table with the rest of the family, sure that the food you have prepared is just for him. He likes to eat and will snack himself into a few extra pounds if you don't carefully monitor his food intake. Under the covers is his preferred place to sleep. Like a heat-seeking missile, he targets the warmest spots he can find. Choose a Devon if you will enjoy the company of a mischievous, agile cat and won't be alarmed to see him peering down at you from the top of a door, plotting the trajectory to your shoulder. Like the Persian, the exotic is sweet, docile and quiet, but don't get the idea that she is merely an adornment for the home. She loves to play when she's not sitting in a lap or being petted. Exotics have a reputation for being more active and curious than their Persian siblings, and they are more suited to an active family. Males are said by some to be sweeter and more affectionate than females, who are sometimes described as aloof. Exotics enjoy batting at toys for as long as you will play with them but are capable of entertaining themselves when their people are busy or away. They follow faithfully after family members and wait patiently for any attention to come their way. 
Exotics are little hurt, but when they do speak it is in a soft, pleasant and musical voice. An exotic's needs are simple, regular meals, a little playtime with a catnip mouse or feather teaser, and lots of love, which is returned many times over. The Devon's wavy coat is easy to maintain. Groom gently so you don't break the delicate hairs. In many cases, brushing your hand over the coat is all it needs. The best thing about a Devon Rex coat is that it doesn't shed much, and the fur is so fine that it isn't very noticeable on clothing and furniture. Baths are rarely necessary unless the cat is white or has a lot of white on the coat. Those cats can start to look dingy if they are not regularly bathed. The coat dries quickly after a bath. The Devon Rex feels warm to the touch, but he is always seeking warmth. If you are cold, he probably is too. Buy him a nice sweater or two to help him retain heat. If possible, build your Devon Rex a large outdoor enclosure where he can jump and climb safely. If your Devon Rex has an outdoor enclosure that allows for sunbathing, be sure to apply cat-safe sunscreen to his body to prevent sunburn. The exotic is often nicknamed the lazy man's Persian. Comb the exotic twice a week to remove dead hair and keep the coat shiny and healthy. A monthly bath is a good idea. Be sure to blow dry the cat thoroughly. Excessive tearing can be a problem in this breed, so wipe the corners of the eyes clean daily to prevent under eye stains from forming. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Wipe the corners of the eyes daily with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check the ears weekly. If they look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50 to 50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. Keep the litter box spotlessly clean. Like all cats, they are very particular about bathroom hygiene. It's a good idea to keep them as an indoor-only cat to protect them from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. The active and social Devon Rex is a perfect choice for families with children and cat-friendly dogs. He will play fetch as well as any retriever, learns tricks easily and loves the attention he receives from children who treat him politely and with respect. Introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. Exotics are adaptable and can do well in homes with children who treat them nicely. They also get along with cat-friendly dogs. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.